how to dress when you wanna go out how to dress when you wanna go out in Panama well my friend don't dress too much you know no really you see see we breathing air we breathing a water here there is no air there is 99 percent humidity you know so what you can dress when you're going out you know you know you you have no idea how you got sweated you know the Florida Florida is is something like a fucking Las Vegas. It's a very dry place, you know, Florida, compared to fucking Panama. So you wear such a shirt, you know, mm, then impossible. Yeah, uno momentero. Uh, perfect. Sí, por favor. Ya. Ya, ya. Ahora. Sí. Perfecto. Bueno. Picho, me si si cierto. You think it's easy to live in a hotel? They always disturb you. <laughs> you want a cleaning? Yeah, I want a fucking. I want a. I want a blowjob. Huh? Yeah. So that's how you would dress when you're going out. Yeah. Be careful because. Yeah, it's good I'm going out now. So light. You see, you have to dress lightly, motherfucker. You have to dress really fucked up casually. The most important, don't wear too many layers. Yeah? Now I'm even thinking if we should I take these fucking sandals. But you know, I don't like shorts. I'm a tropical man. I'm a businessman. I always wear fucking long trousers. I'm uncomfortable in these faggot shorts, you see? Look like a fag. I look like a fag. Look like an American fag. V fucking tourist. One big camera with the, you know, with the cute motherfucking... How are you, honey? What is Disneyland? Huh? But hey, no way. You have to, you have to take a shot. You have to take a shot. Or cotton t-shirt, motherfucker. 100% cotton t-shirt. Now you will see... What is it like? You put this shit out so it breathes. And now I show you how is it like when you're going out in Panama. Yeah? I, I'm telling you, and don't you scream. That's what I, that's a bad, bad thing, you know. Don't use any cream, nothing, you know. Now look. Cocksuckers. But you know what? I didn't came here for a holiday. I came here to make a money because I figure out if in fucking Miami there are hundred millionaires, here are billionaires. Here is where the Mr. Putin put his money. Here is where the fucking Lavrov put his money. You see, all politicians, former Argentinian presidents, Arabic kings, all these fucks, you know, all these motherfuckers are here. So, you know, they don't wear a fucking rights watch here. Fuck you. Fuck you. You know, you know what they wear here? A fucking Pili Piatek. I walk down the fucking street. You, you think somebody wearing some fucking thirty, forty thousand dollar watch? You cheap fuck. Get the fucking bag where you come from to the cheap fuck shitland hole to fucking Miami. Here, they wear a Pili Piatek, motherfucker. You see, and I want my Pili Piatek. They took my Armani. I'm an Armani boy. I was a Rolex boy. I'll be again a Rolex boy. But I want to be now a fucking Pili fucking Piatek boy. Because Philip Piatek, my friend, you know, you snatch Philip Piatek from somebody, you, you snatch her, you know, you snatch Philip Piatek fucking watch. You buy five fucking condos for each one, one million dollar downtown in Toronto. <laughs> it's a serious business. What the fuck is the comp? Why the fuck I have to look for fucking everything in my fucking life? Why? Why my balls? One ball is in North America, another one is in South America. Always I have to look for fucking sun. This is my life. I hear you, you little, little bitch. You little bitch. You hide from daddy? That's what you got, motherfucker, when you're hiding. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> So let's go out.
Maybe there will be fucking Lavrov or some motherfucker. I snatch his Philippe Yate watch. I buy three other apartments in Malaga. You see? That's, that's a serious business. So you ready? Let's go, old motherfucker. Cocksucker. <sighs> you know, we are not just outside and I feel it. It's like you are in the laundry. I mean, of course, this country is serious laundry. I'm not joking, right? It's a money laundry shit. But I'm talking something else. I'm talking the temperature. It's like suddenly it's so heavy, it's so hot. It's like... <gasps> the fuck? <gasps> okay. Let's go out. Man, I feel like, I don't know how to describe it, but the temperature rising up is like, the fuck? Uh. Oh. Oh. Now I am outside. I wish you to experience the feeling, it's like, it's like I went into the literary, like somebody put me into the fucking laundry, which they are giving us a lot of pride only. It's a... It's like 99% weight, bitch. And now you look, I pause it for two minutes, I'll be sweated like quick. Hey, I will be just posted and I will have to work on the three vole Panamskih, Puerto Ricanskih sestrach, bicho, vole s vole strojitim, popičenim, vole bypassem, bicho, vole 65, vole zezadu na ně pracoval, protože to, hej, když pracuješ na nich zezadu, to jedeš, bicho, to jsou ty, to jsou ty zádový svaly, bicho, to se potíš jak prase, vole, bicho, to se, <laughs> no ty vole, to je vedro jak piči, No to je ve druhé piči. No ty táto vole. Maximální táto vole. Já jdu pro keš, pičo, táto teďka. Já jdu pro keš, já, já. Jo, jo. No ty vole, je tady trošku horko. Trošku víc, pičo. Hej, to je jak když tě obalí, pičo, vole, já nevím, vole, jak vata, pičo, horká, vole, když vyjdeš na ulici. Pičo, je to vůbec možný, vole, vůbec. Hej, tady sedm měsíců, pičo, z roku a nemůžeš dýchat v Panamě. To ti neřeknou, pičo. Prší tady, pičo. Jsou tady bouřky tropický. No ty vole, sleduj, jak se ty brýle začínají rosit, pičo. Ty pičo. Sleduj to, pičo. Sleduj ty mračno. Jaj, ty pičo.